Hey, it's Mr. Glista bringing you ETC 10. It's been a while. Uh, the last one I did was with my grandma Rosario. I hope you checked that one out. That was a lot of fun. But back to the solo pods. And this one is going to be a shout out episode because I've encountered so many cool bands and so many cool people since the last podcast. And I've talked about myself enough, so I really want to give some credit where credit is due and introduce you to some people that are doing some really cool things that I want to recognize because, uh, you know, it's been tough to find inspiration this year, if I'm being honest. Like, music just has not struck me the same. I haven't been, like, as inspired to record things or write things, but gosh, lately seeing these bands has really, like, reignited the fire so i just want to do some shout outs so first and foremost once again the omnitones uh i saw them at a venue down in lyle called base camp which is also a really cool venue by the way really good place to see shows and they blew me away um they get better every time i see them live um i actually got hired for another photo assignment for them so i was honored to take pictures which i'm probably gonna have a little slideshow going right now and uh, they sounded fantastic. And they're just, uh, sometimes you hear bands like online or you hear their recorded stuff and you're like, oh, they just, I wonder if they could pull this off live. And they don't always, but man, these guys deliver. They are legit, very talented musicians all across the board. They got lots of tricks up their sleeve. And uh, their new EP is fantastic. It's been stuck in my head for months now or rather a month um but just wonderful songwriting very creative well produced i was actually um tasked with mastering their song deep end and i was a little nervous because i was such a fan of it um it's really what turned me on to them in the first place and i was like oh god i better do a good job and as i was <laughs> listening to the ep it's the fourth song and right before it got to it, I was like, oh my God, I hope this sounds as good as the previous three did. And sure enough, it sounded great. It worked well with the rest of them. It seemed like it fit right in there. So I was proud of myself and my engineering work. And just that EP is wonderful. I highly recommend it. So check out the Omnitones right after you listen to this podcast. Or perhaps you'd rather listen to Sunset Drip who opened for the Omnitones, and these guys were amazing too. I was really impressed. They're one of those bands that makes me want to go home and pick up my guitar right away, just because I'm like, God, they're having so much fun. I want to do that too. Um, they covered Hot for Teacher by Van Halen, and my God, just like from the, from the get-go, the intro was spot on with the whole like crazy, uh, almost sounds like a dirt bike the drum intro and like the guitar solo and everything these guys are just really really good i'll probably insert a clip of it here because i took a video i was so impressed So, Sunset Drip, another really good local band to check out. And last but not least, I also got the privilege of seeing a band called The Tall Boys. Now, they don't have original music yet, but if any of them are listening to this, please, for the love of God, guys, write some songs, some original stuff, because their cover set was amazing, and they dug deep, um, played some stuff that I'm really fond of that not necessarily everybody's gonna know but if you ask me that's the best kind of band to see I don't want to hear people covering Sweet Caroline in the same BS that everybody else covers like I've heard it a million times I don't need to hear you play it too but uh, these guys oh my god blew me away just incredible musicianship they're only a three-piece kind of like the bubs originally were and the very full sound, very fun performance. Uh, Lawrence, their front man, has a lot of charisma. He was cracking us up between songs and everything. Um, 
Two of the best songs they played were Are You In by Incubus, which I took a little video of. I'll just place that in here. Arpeggii Weird Fishes by Radiohead, which I have never heard a band play that live. Not even Radiohead, and God, it was good. I wish I'd taken a video of that too, but I was too busy with my jaw on the floor, just in awe listening to it. So, The Tall Boys, wonderful, wonderful local band as well. I can't wait to hear them again, and I hope they come out with some original stuff, because man, they're good. Um, I would also like to give a big shout out to City Neon Shop. Um, my girlfriend actually works with Dima Demet Demetrius, I want to say is his name. Sorry if I got that wrong, but uh, Dima is an incredibly talented artist and he makes these neon custom signs with uh, artwork spliced into them sometimes and it's just really cool, really unique original artwork if you're looking for like a gift coming up for this holiday season look no further city neon shop they got really good stuff check out their instagram check out their website i'm gonna put links to all these bands and all these uh creators down below in the comments but yeah i was very impressed i wanted him to design me a mystiglista logo light for like live performances on stage and I just sent him an Instagram message with my signature and said like, hey, can you make this but in neon? I'll be damned. Within, I think it was like a week, he had the thing finished. He gave it to my girlfriend, she brought it over to me and I was like, oh my God, this is incredible. So I can't wait to take that on the road and show it off during my shows because it is the coolest thing I've ever received, quite possibly. So thank you, Dima. You did a fantastic job. Go follow City Neon Shop. Another shout out, because let me just keep them rolling, is my friend Brian Fink, who I met through Disc Golf. He's been making custom jewelry. I believe it's uh, Fink Jewelry? Brian Fink Jewelry? I'll have to double check the name. <laughs> Probably should have double checked before I started recording this, but uh, I'll put a link to that down below too. He makes these really cool custom jewelry pieces with like precious stones that he wraps with this silver wire. And it almost looks like guitar string, it's really cool, but just beautiful pieces. I was seeing them on his uh, Facebook page and I was like, I gotta get one of these as a gift for one of the women in my life. And the first one I got was for my girlfriend, this fat garnet stone that he custom wrapped and I gave it to her a couple months ago and she loved it. Um, has worn it since and it looks fantastic. I think it looks great on her, so thank you, Brian Fink. And uh, I did get another custom piece, an opal, that is just beautiful, especially in the sunlight, the way it reflects the light. And uh, I'm not gonna say who that's for yet because it's a holiday gift coming up, but uh, I'm sure she's gonna like that too. So check out Fink Jewelry. Handmade, custom, one-of-a-kind pieces. They're very, very cool. I highly recommend checking him out. And uh, last but not least, um, thank you to my friend Dan Karras. He got me this really cool 70th anniversary Stratocaster uh, Fender book that I guess showcases the history of the Stratocaster guitar. I just kind of opened it up and flipped through it real quick. Awesome photos and history in there. So thank you for the birthday gift, Dan. Um, I turned 35 this month. 35 years young, at least I try to tell myself, <laughs> but you know, I'm happier and healthier than I've ever been, so I do truly believe that age is just a number, but uh, to wrap things up, I want to give a shout out to the Omnitones once again with Deep End, covered by me, because I absolutely love this song, so hopefully I do it justice. <laughs> Drove back from dinner tonight For some reason 
and I was so mad Cause everything is good in the end And I have no idea how It went off the deep end This crazy town Crashed together Now we can walk together C10. Hope you enjoyed that. Go check out the Omnitones. Check out the Tall Boys. Check out Sunset Drip. Check out the Bubs. Check out Mr. Glista Falsetto. I don't know. Catch you next time. Have a good one. <laughs>